Hey, what up, everybody? Yes, sir. It's beat up and the woo star ITB Next Level Podcast. Podcast. Coming to you live. Yes, sir. What's up, everybody? How you feeling? What's up? What's up? Yes, sir. We are in the building. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? We don't own the rights to this music. It's our boy, though. Nobody knows. That's our boy. Nobody knows. Once again. The worst pain of earth seen God of vengeance like when the curse came The curse came You should have used caution as your first time Yes sir You fit it for a coping when you first came Busting your brain How's everybody feeling? Hope everybody feeling good Yes sir 38 West 95th Street Yes sir P Barber Supply Right next door, 1634, West 95th Street, it's Time Barbershop. Yes, sir. Shout out to my girl, Nikki. Shout out to Nikki. And her son, they come get their hair cut right here. 1634, West 95th Street, it's Time Barbershop. Yes, sir. She also has a music label. Uh... And I'm going to make sure I get that right. I don't want to get no bad information. Well. Yes, sir. So if I find that, I'm just going to let y'all know that today is Thursday, September 22nd, 2022. The time is uh, 4.16 p.m. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, everybody. Yeah, my girl Nikki, uh, she's the CEO of Dillion's Foundation of Music and Arts, a non for profit corporation. And she's also a notary of Republic. So check her out, Nikki Giovanni. You can check her out on Facebook. Once again, shout out to her and her son who come get their hair cut. Nikki Appreciate Giovanni. it, Nikki. Definitely. And her son. Man, yes, yes. Children. In the building. Man, well, we got some birthday shots out today. Oh, yeah. We got some birthday shots out. Today. Yes, sir. First of all, I'd like to give a, a warm shout out to my my brother, uh, William Hill. Bill Hill. Yes, sir. Birthday, birthday, birthday. birthday. Oh, yeah. Big Bill Ski. <laughs> yes, sir. Shout out to the Billster. The Billster. Yes, sir. Give a shout out to my man Stanley Boyd over there from the Grand Crossing area. Young Drive Stanley. them trucks. What up, Stan? Happy birthday to you, my brother. Happy birthright. Birthday, birthday, birthday. Birthday, birthday, birthday. Shout out to Mike Riley, which is Keith's little cousin. Okay. Yes, sir. And Gooch cousin, Mike. Mike Riley. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Y'all see my business partner walk behind me. That's, yes, sir. That's young Detroit the barber. Yes. D Town in the building. D Town in the building. Yes, sir. That's what we talking about. D Town is in the building. Mm -hmm. That's what we talking about, man. It's a beautiful day outside. Uh, like my brother said, it's in the uh low sixties, oh, mid sixties. In the sixties. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we gonna be heading out later on. To yep. 31st Street going down Beach. To 31st. We're going to get some, some house music up in us. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah. This may be the last day. Might be the last one. Shout out to my boy Henny. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Nobody knows. Y'all see my business partner walk behind Yes, sir. <laughs> What's up with you? Nobody knows. Yes, sir. Shouts out to my man, Honey Sanai Atun Red. Yes, sir. That yes, is what's sir. up. Y'all just heard it, some of that it, hot yeah, music, the man. From nobody knows. knows. Yes, sir. It's here, what man. What should sound like? Get your copy now. Yes, sir. You can go on uh, HTTPS backslash backslash nobody knows dot com backslash. Yep. And get your uh, copy of what rap should sound like. <laughs> what up, Killer Khan? What's crack a lacking? I see you in the building, Con. Yes, sir. What's popping with you today, Con? What you got for us, man? Come on with something, man. I know you got a question or two. Mm -hmm. Hit us with some or, or a statement or two. Come on, man. 
Open up. Let's open up them craniums. Oh yeah. Let's get it cracking. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Come on with it, Killer Khan. How was your day at work, my brother? <laughs> marriage. What about marriage? <laughs> the mirage, huh? What's up, nephew? Isaiah. Mm -hmm. What's up, Zay? You and Nisi. Ayanda, I know y'all down there in the GA kicking it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I can't wait to get down there in the GA, man. I love Georgia, man. Yeah, I love Georgia, too, man. Killer Khan say marriage ain't for everyone. That's true. Marriage really ain't for everybody. It's not for everybody, man. <laughs> it's really not for everybody, Killer Khan. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and it, all, it all depends on what type of marriage. You know, right? You know, if if you if you got a got a uh, one of those binding marriages by the by the state or the or the city or the or the country that you mm -hmm. live in, you know, then that's man. Sometimes that 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 don't work for nobody. <laughs> I got you with that question, nephew, about the purge in Chicago, but. With Killer Khan, he talking about this marriage right now. Um, also, you learning that that's called experience. That's how you learn about your marriage when you have an experience. You can't know no other way. You can't learn from your boy or your sister or brother. No, you have to go through it yourself. That's you the only way go you're going to know. You have to go through it, man. You have to experience it, man. And it's not for everybody, you know. And you got to remember the, the way that the West... Uh, Portray it. Portray it as, you know, you have to have the picket fence, the white, you know, white picket fence, the house, the car, the lady. The two kids. You know what I'm saying? Got to get the ring and all that. You know what I'm saying? The rings, that's new. If, if don't nobody know, look up the De Beers. It's a diamond company. And their reason for even portraying marriages was to get their sales up. You know what I'm saying? So... Mm -hmm. That was the whole thing about what, how marriages really came in the park. They were really trying to sell rings, you know what I'm saying, get their diamonds up. Right. So check out the De Beers. You, you, uh, you know, do some research on it, and you'll see where it really comes from. Because the true marriage or merge is compilation. Yes, sir. That's the true marriage. When one man and a woman comes together and they have intercourse, that's, copulation. that's yep. the copulation. That's, that's the marriage. true marriage. That's the true merge. You know. Same thing as in the Bible. When a man leaves, when a woman when uh, man leaves his family, right. <laughs> cling on to his woman man. and become one flesh. One that, flesh. That's the merge. One flesh. It. One flesh. One flesh. <laughs> and the concept of, if you watch, see my finger, see the hole, see the ring, see the concept, mm -hmm. the phallus, the vagina. To say, it's, that's where the concept comes from. Indeed. It's the whole concept. You know what I'm saying? That's where they got it from. That's the natural merge when a man and woman comes together and they create a child. That is what the that is what the true marriage is. Right. You know what I'm saying? You know, There's others times, really to make money. All the times in the Bible when you heard Adam knew Eve. Right. And he begot and she begat such and such and such, and such, and such begat <laughs> right his you wife again right you know what I'm saying you, you, yes sir uh, you gotta know somebody to be married yes uh, sir <laughs> and that's how you get to know them very well right <laughs> so again it's all a, a play on words it's plagiarism you know what I'm saying with the words of course you know uh, again, we always <laughs> you say these niggas smart as hell. <laughs> hey, G, we ain't smart, man. We just choose to want to know. Right. That's all that is. Same thing. And, and it's been years and years and years going through different schools of thought. Oh, that's right. And, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So, yep. I mean, shoot, I, I done been a Christian, a Baptist, a, 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 been a Muslim, a Muslim. Muslim. <laughs> right. I done been a Yes, sir. Uh, 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 you name it, I done been it, <laughs> Yes, sir. <man. laughs> Voodooism, all that. Yeah, we go voodoo, keep it one thousand. We've been through it. We didn't been. We experienced it. It ain't like we just talking about it. We experienced it. So, me and my brother, yes, we definitely been through those schools of thought. Yes, sir. And that was how the master teacher taught us. He said the only way you will know if you go through it, you will never go through it by listening to somebody tell you about it 
reading a book about it, seeing it on TV. You'll never know until you go through the actual. At one point, we was even cowboys. Facts. <laughs> Which we are the original cowboys anyway, yeah. so, and cowgirls. But yeah, nephew, uh, the, when you say what's going on with the purge in Chicago, shit, that's everywhere. <laughs> It ain't just Chicago, nephew. That 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 purge is everywhere. If you want to call it that, Man. if that's what you call it, it, you know what I'm saying. They trying to create uh, chaos everywhere because they need to change. They need to change the laws, mm -hmm. or should I say, the uh, statutes and uh, statutes and codes. codes, because they don't go by the laws. They've been stopped going by the laws. Right. They they add stuff. They 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 they. Like they'll change a, a, with, a, with an amendment, you know what I'm saying? Yep. With a statute or yep. a code. You with know a code, I mean? exactly. And then they'd be like Article 316.754. You know, that, uh, that ain't what the true uh, laws. The laws were we the people mm -hmm. to form a perfect union. That is the actual true laws that we were supposed to be going by, you know, but they changed it. Yes, COVID-19 was the beginning of the new world order to change it. Because you got to remember, it affected the whole world. Mm -hmm. New world order. Not yeah, new city or new state, new country, a new continent. No, new world order. It changed they, the whole that's world. They, that's why they termed it a pan. Dude. Right, a pan. A pan, meaning the whole. Oh, that's right. Same thing for Pan Africa. Like <laughs> Just pan, planet. <laughs> Pangea. Pangea. Oh, okay. That's right. And this planet is so definitely the whole thing. cover the whole thing. And like I just told Wu, they just talked about the Titanic place, uh, Titanic plate shifting over there in Benin, or what we call Ethiopia. Yeah. It just shifted and created a Wait, whole new ocean amazon's came. check it out look it up <laughs> don't believe me research it just created the titanic place just, i'm talking about two land masses just shifted and created a whole new land mass yes it did so you can research this and look it up come on d-town what you got for us baby tell us about some of that d-town baby <laughs> <What up, Detroit? laughs> look at the store right now. oh <laughs> no doubt man yes sir gotta get that work together baby that's right, that's right. yeah man yeah, but definitely, man. Uh, Y'all do some research on that, man. You know, definitely. COVID nineteen was definitely the beginning of the pan. That's why they called the it a pandemic. Pan. Yep, pan. Yeah, mm -hmm. father of music. Supposedly. <laughs> oh, you say you seen a video of the CPD explaining something of the extent of policing. Being handled by civilians, yeah, uh, yeah. Well, you know, in reality, we should be policing ourselves. To be honest, well, see, and, and that, but that's when people, <laughs> people, uh, right now, they they call it for the removal mm -hmm. of the police force. Yep, you know what I'm saying? Because they 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 wanted to go back to when it was it was no police force, right? And the people police themselves. Right. But that's not going to work. And that ain't what we really want. Because then you bring, <laughs> right. you bring in the military. Right. And that will, will, that will cause uh, martial law. And that's and you exactly don't, what it is. And you don't want that. Law. You don't want martial law because then you got curfews. And they're going to tell you when to go, where to go, how to go. Your, your, your house is not your haven anymore. Nope. You know what I'm saying? It belongs to them. It belongs to them. Facts. So you don't, we don't really want that. We think we be wanting certain stuff, but that ain't what you really want. That's why I say it's always important to research whenever something they talk about. That's why it's good to stay up on your current events. You know what I'm saying? Or what's going on around the world. So you'll know. And then you can research it because they're going to put it out. They got to put it out there. Mm -hmm. You know, one thing they always have, they always have sessions. Congress always have sessions, but we don't watch it. We don't pay attention. We don't listen to what they do. And you actually have a chance to uh, be on that floor and make decisions. But again, if you don't know, you know what I'm saying? How yeah, can every, everything everything uh, that's going on in the change, 
is going to happen be, by January 2023. Three. Facts. Because that, remember, that, goes back, that goes back to when we was talking about, about the Philadelphia, Philadelphia experiment, experiment in yep. 1943, Three. 1953, 1963, 73, and on, and on, on up. to 2023. Three. Where we at right you now. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And that's the shifting of everything. The planet. The, the, the uh, multiverses, everything is shifting. Mm -hmm. It truly is. And you can see it. Condolences to Ramsey and Harris family, Charlie P. and Eli. Oh, man. Eli made his transition. Uh, Zay, I didn't know that, man. Eli. From yeah, from 75. I didn't oh. know. I knew his brother made his transition, but I didn't know Eli did too, man. Definitely, man. Our condolences to them, man. I did not know Eli made his transition. I knew Charlie Wally did, man. Oh, man. That's a tough one. Them some young brothers. And both of those brothers young are definitely brother. young yeah. brothers, man. Charlie P can't be no older than about 51, 52. And Eli, oh, Eli passed Boys. today. Eli passed today, man. And Eli's, she, Eli ain't even in his 40s. Eli about 30, 30 something. Dang, man. My condolences to the family, man. Yeah. Definitely, man. Definitely. De and some real good brothers, too, man. They definitely were some real good brothers, man. My shout out and my condolences to the family. Oh, he was 40 on the head. Mm -hmm. he just made 40. Wow. Oh, boy, boy, boy. Yep. As I say, his age. I know that was your guy, man. Damn, I'm sorry to hear that, Zay. Oh, man. Transitions are to be made. But, you know, when they when it's kind of young like that, you know, you kind of be like, man. You know, but. Dang. That's a toughie. Definitely a toughie. Hey, Sherry. Yep, I just want to say, uh, give us a, 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 a Belated birthday shout out to my my man Grandmaster Dana Andrews. Yes, sir, Grandmaster. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's over there at um out there in the hundreds, right? Mm -hmm. Uh and, and um Harvey. Yes, sir. Shout out to that brother. Shout out Doula. What up, Doula? What up, Doula? You can't make Doula do it. <laughs> <laughs> can't make Doula do it. Yeah, I want to give a, 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 a belated birthday shout out to my girl, uh, Yvonne Boss Baby Blackwell. Yes, sir. Uh, one of my classmates, grammar school. What's up, Boss Baby? Birthday, birthday, birthday. birthday. Yes, sir. That's a tough one there, though. What Zay just hit me with, man. Eli, man. Yeah, that's tough, man. man. Eli and them, man. Zay, how you and the family doing, man? How's everybody doing down there in the GA? Killer Khan, where you at? <laughs> Man, that's 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 a toughie though, Wooski. Yep, I wanna give a a warm uh birthday shout out to my man Reginald Hunt. He he one of the brothers, you know what I'm saying? What's up, brother Reginald Hunt? Mm hmm Yes, sir. Oh, okay. Yes, sir. Yeah. Shout out to that brother Reginald. Yes, yeah, sir. Shout out to all the black-owned businesses. The sciences. Shout out to the black-owned businesses. Mm -hmm. And we're going to give a shout out to some that ain't even black. Uh, no doubt. We're going to give a shout out to Top Notch down the street. Oh, man. Top yeah. Notch. Man. Off the chain. Top Notch Burger, y'all. Right on 95th. On 95th. Whew. We just had some of that. Yeah, they was they awesome. So shout out to Top Notch. Definitely. Mm -hmm. <laughs> They got they got the brothers and sisters working down there though. Yep. So <laughs> yeah. shout out to them, man. Yeah, it shout was definitely to top notch. definitely was uh yummy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> turkey burger that is, a turkey burger. Hand packed turkey burger. It actually was awesome. Yep, yeah, I went to a, uh to a little spot the other day. It's called uh Ooh We Chicken and ribs. Ooh, we chicken and ribs. And it is located on 181st and Roy Street in Lansing, Illinois. 
they not affiliated with ooh we sweet tea people mm. but this is black owned business in Lansing 181st and Roy ooh mm. chicken and ribs ooh we chicken got, and ribs what makes them what differentiates them from other rib joints they got chicken turkey beef and pork mm. on the tips and links so you can get you some chicken tips and chicken links you can get you some pork tips and pork links you can get you some beef <laughs> tips and beef links you can get you some turkey tips and turkey links yes sir so they got the whole gamut and guess what they don't, they don't serve tea because they're not affiliated with Ooh Wee Sweet Tea. Mm. They serve Kool Aid. Mm. They got Ooh Wee Kool Aid. <laughs> Ooh Wee Kool Aid. Ooh Wee. I bet that's flame. Man, they sauce was off the chain. Was it? It was good. Yeah, barbecue <laughs> was good, brother. Man, we're going to have to check it out. Yes, sir. 181st and Roy Street. Let me get y'all the, 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 uh, here we go. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, the Woodstock. Coming to you raw and live. I'm sitting here in uh, Ooby Chicken and Ribs in Lansing. The address is. What's that? <laughs> What's that? 18155 Roy Street. Roy! 18155 Roy Street. <laughs> Roy Street. Chicken and ribs. Y'all see they they their email address for their uh website. Once again, that's 18155 Roy Street in Lansing, Illinois. Yes, sir. Ooh wee, chicken and ribs. Mm, mm, mm. It sounds good right now. Sound like I want some right now. Ooh wee, chicken and ribs. Uh, breaking news right now. Uh, four people shot. <laughs> That's crazy. Four people were shot in the Bronzeville area just now. Uh, a little bit before 4 p.m. on 35th and Perary. So that's right down by the by the spot where we've been to go. Yeah. 31st. <laughs> it is, but it ain't. But it ain't. You know. <laughs> It is what it ain't. But all the four people that were shot are in good condition, so that's good to know. It's just a fact, man. When is it going to stop? Uh, it's kind of hard to say. Yeah, and, you know, to the woman that threw her three-year-old baby in Lake Michigan, uh, mm. that goes back to what we talk about men mental anguish, man. When, when people don't... Be recognize when someone has a problem and um, things like that happen because I'm sure somebody knew what was going on. I'm sure of it. Mm -hmm. 
And to hear about a, a woman throwing her three-year-old baby into Lake Michigan, man, come on now, man. That's 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 that that's really bad. That is really bad. That's terrible. That's man. So I don't like hearing stuff like that. And it's actually a video. They had a video of it showing her uh, three-year-old nephew. That's what it was. Three-year-old nephew into to the lake. Man, that's crazy, man. Yeah. Also, uh, I hope you don't drink that water out the faucet <laughs> because uh, the shocking levels of toxic toxic lead in Chicago's yeah. tap water is off the chain. Yeah, we, we looking like Flint, Michigan. You know what I mean? So, man, be careful with that water, man. Get you some, get you some if you got to, get you some bottled water. So definitely, man, be careful with that. Mm -hmm. Yep. And they said two was wounded in the drive-by in Bronzeville, but it was actually four. Mm. Oh, Chatham is finna uh, a $5 million uh, Chatham car wash approved by the city a day after the neighbors protested. So they finna put a brand new car wash uh, in Chatham. Right there on, um, where is they going to put this brand? 83rd in Chatham. 83rd? 83rd Street in Chatham. They just got 83rd. Mm. Let me see. Well, nope. 357 West 83rd Street. So, you know where that's by? That's in between St. Lawrence and... That's right off of King Drive. Yep, King Drive. Facts. Yep. Right off of King Drive. Yep. So they're going to put that right. It's probably going to be the, 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 the gas station. Well, nope. Probably right there where the uh, whatchamacallit used to be. Probably where the... Um, Kentucky? Nope. Where the cleaners at. Well, the cleaner in the, the, cleaners the, in the you laundromat. Know, yep, the, the laundromat. Then remember that used to be the um, sheriff or the uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that used to be their station right there too. All that parking lot right there. It used to be uh, uh, state police. State police, right? That's what it was. State police. So they probably gonna put it there where the state police is at. I could see that too. That's uh crazy. That's taking jobs away from people. Because uh, only people control is the people that control it, it's, and that's really like one. Or <laughs> excuse me, one or two people. Mm -hmm. Yep. What's up, Lou? I see you, brother. Ah, Lou. Hey, what up, Lou? He shouts out to my sister Shari. Yep. Yeah, Lou. No, that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be right there by uh, by King Drive, Lou. And yeah, cute little, cute little uh, child too, man. That was thrown in there too. Yeah, I seen that. That's crazy, man. That was a nephew. So that that's nuts. Mm -hmm. That is nuts, man. Yeah, and you know, I, sometimes I'll be watching the, the the little stuff on uh, on on Facebook and Instagram. And, and YouTube, mm -hmm. uh, crazy videos or whatever, and I, I know everybody seen the one where the lady ran ran over her. Uh, I guess she ran her boyfriend over, and some other people walking past. Damn. And then she got out, and then after she ran them over, she got out the car and went over there and started beating up on her boyfriend. Wow! All because he got some some uh. Some kind of some 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 uh some uh text messages. You know what I'm saying? That is crazy. Shout out to my dear brother Trevor. Young Trevor John Charles. Yes, sir. Yes. Shout out to him and his wife. They got their own real estate business, man. Mm -hmm. Shout out to them. Black owned business. 
always a shout out to you, my brother. And they motivational speakers. Yep, and motivational speakers. That's right. Packy facts. They need to come on and motivate some people. Huh. Quite a few people. Be honest. Heck yeah. Yep, but me and the brother Wu, uh, we got some things coming up. Uh, first, let me give a shout out to my boy, Saw Production, Sakoon Walker. <laughs> Uh, October 15th, Swedish Day. It uh, used to be Captain Hard Times, now called uh, Josephine's. Mm -hmm. Right on 79th and uh, Vernon. Uh, what is it, 16? It's 4. 4. Oh. 436. Oh, is it 436? Why do I always say 16? Because <laughs> we 16. We 16, uh, right. It's 430. You're right, it is 436. Yes, sir. Yep, and um, West 79th, East West 79th Street, uh, East 79th, East, East 79th, it's gonna, yep, it's going to be uh, Marlon Mitchell, uh, B. Cole, uh, Blair Christensen, Blair Christensen, yep, and the King of Chicago comedy, Mike Sam, Mike Sam, and they're going to also have some music, uh, some surprise music there. Shout out to my little nephews. Got the uh, Smoke Volume 1 album out. Yeah, he's a, he's a, he, and he also got a, a, a music uh, performance by Jay Felon. Yep. Jay Felon. Yes, sir. So shout out to that brother, Sukun. Also, October 15th. Right. Next door at 1634 West 95th Street, we're going to be celebrating the owner of It's Time Barbershop and co-owner of WDT Barber Supplies. Barber Supplies right here at 1638 West 95th Street. So, my man Tom McCall is going to be having his birthday right next door at 1634 West 95th Street, October 15th, man. So... Y'all ain't doing nothing. Come on out, man. Kick it with us because we're going to go hard in the paint. We're going hard in the paint for my mans. Yeah, you know us. We're going to be at both events. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to be from one to the other. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we're going to get it in. Definitely going to get it in. And yes, we are. You don't know me. Huh. You don't know me. Cool. You just owe me, fool. <laughs> I don't need your resistance. So, so, iced tea. Wow. Yep, that's all I'm going to say. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy, man. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. that, boy, that, that boy went from uh, cop killer. <laughs> cop killer to, to, to cop. <laughs> Yes, sir. From cop killer to cop. And was never in no gangs ever. That was Whoa, just the pimp. front. He was pimping. Pimping. Also, man, y'all be careful down there on 75th, man. Um, you know, there's some foolery going on. Uh, two people got shot. About one something this morning on 75th in Michigan down by the 50. So people came out the alley. So be careful, man. Hanging out late at night, 1, 2 at night on 75th Street and any other street, actually. Because we just had a woman get shot in the neck a couple of nights ago right here on 95th in Ashland. So, mm -hmm. And this right here in Beverly. So, you know, man, that, that, that I call that a whole nother world after 12 o'clock. <laughs> after 12 Shit change. Period. Point blank. It just goes bananas. For real. It really gets bananas after 12 o'clock, man. On the real. That's a whole nother world. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. Shout out to the 78th Street Posse. Vernon. Yes, sir. Shout out to them brothers. Shout out to 78th Street Posse. My brothers. Yes, sir. 
This is a uh, ITB Next Level Podcast coming to you live. Sixteen thirty eight West Ninety Fifth Street. WDT Bar Supplies. Supplies. Right, right next, next door, door to, to Sixteen Thirty Four West Ninety Fifth Street. It's, it's time, time barbershop. barbershop. Yes, sir. Yeah, y'all come on down. Get your braids and fades. You know what I'm saying. Also, <laughs> I have another company. It's called. Uh, Guy to LLC and it's, get uh, your think get, up stands for get your think up and uh, I do the oils. Yes, sir. How much are these? Uh, these are it's a whole ounce for twenty dollars, and then you get the, the the quarter ounce for five dollars. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? I do the soaps. We selling. We selling. I do the shea butter. Man, we selling that thing. I quarter do ounces. Candles. I do all kind of stuff. So. Yes, Y'all come on down and, and check me out. You're right, Lou. Shirts. Creeps do come out at night. <laughs> creeps come out at night. Yeah, we need to do a we need night. to do a remix on that. Lou, put you and uh uh Star Ra Star. Mm -hmm. Do a song called "Creeps Come Out at Night." <laughs> come out. Yes, sir. Uh, big ups to Houdini. Yep, big ups to Houdini. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Yeah, but me and my co-host, Wu Star, we getting it together, man. Um, slowly but surely. But like we said, uh, starting soon, we're going to be having comedy shows. We're going to be doing doing the comedy in inside of uh, It's Time Barbershop. Yep. Yep. On 1634 West 95th Street. Mm-hmm. Starting at the end of October. October. Yes, sir. So get ready. Get and ready. what's kicking it off is Tone McCall's birthday. Right. <laughs> so all the flies and all of the uh, promotional paraphernalia, it'll be out there mm -hmm. for you real soon. ITB in the building. In the building. Yes, sir. Presented by ITB. Guy 2, get your think up. WDT Supplies and It's Time Barbershop. Oh, yeah. And we're looking for sponsorship. So, uh, anybody that want to um, sponsor ITB Next Level Podcast, uh, we're more than welcome. We can get you some promos and everything. Hey. Promos, not primos, <laughs> promos. <laughs> Oh, All right, they said he get some primos. Yeah, primos. Yes, sir. They got Ooh, primos. Thirty-seven fifties. Yes, sir. No <laughs> promos. Promos, y'all. <laughs> yes, sir. Pat Patrick Harford commented. <laughs> what did he say? He said, "Dub mics up." My mics up. Your mics up, Dub. Can you hear me now? I bet you can. <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you, my brother. Nigaru. Nigaru. Tawul and Tukje Katua. Thank you very much. Yes, sir, my brother. Appreciate it. He said no. Good. Okay. Good. It's all good. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'll probably have my mic down a little bit. Can you, um, it's all good now, Tank? He said his hand's too tied. <laughs> Your hand's always tied, man. Too tied for him to hold on to the rope. Uh, oh. Excuse me? I move for a move. I move for a move. So you want to move for a move? Do you want to move before I move? Do I want to move before you move? Uh, oh. I hit you. I hit you up. I hit you, let you. Hey, we going down the thirty first. Huh? Going down the thirty first. <laughs> he look like mm -hmm. not me. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh huh? Would you say, Lou? You love to see old, love to see old school sunshine come back, huh? Shoe shine come back, I mean. Yeah, he said Joe Mike really low. Who said that? Tank? Yeah. I don't know why. Let me see some. Hold on. Oop. It probably up now. I think I had cut it down. It should be up. I ain't really good. I 
I do too. Uh, yeah, no. Oh, he might be talking about because of your mic. You know, he might be because I'm mic overshadowing your. Uh, no, probably because the way you got it, and he can't hear me. Yeah, <laughs> right. <there. laughs> so that's why I normally put them like in the middle in case you can hear both. You know, so they can hear both of us. So that's probably why he's saying he can't hear my mic. My mic sounds nice. Check one. I'm quite sure that's what it is. Oh, he just did this and lowered it. I bet he can hear me now. Let me see something. Yeah, that's loud. That's louder, ain't it? Woo -woo. The woo star. Definitely the woo star. Can you hear me now, Tank? <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. I'm sure, Tank. That's exactly what it is. But you should be able to hear both of us. Indeed. Should be able to hear both. Hey, what up, Donnie? What up, sis? That's Miss Hicks. Yes, yes. <laughs> what up, Donnie? Tell my brother Earl of Pearl I said what up. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Where's I'm in Rasta today? <clears throat> he chilling. Let's see. We got to. He said, y'all all the way up, bro. So that's tank raggedy uh, equipment then. <laughs> <laughs> tank, that's uh, your equipment. Yeah, your volume down, bro. <laughs> oh, man. Too funny. Too funny. It's all good. As long as you can hear me. I swear, we all the way up, huh? He said, y'all all the way up, bro. <laughs> mm -hmm. I figured that this tank microphone checker one two checker yeah it's up what did he do he just what he say woo <laughs> I know he said something so yeah Joe Mike sucks Joe <laughs> Mike really sucks whatever nah he said he, he said he said, now he can hear you oh, okay. much better. Yeah, that's because you can turn your, uh, your raggedy demo up. Mm -hmm. Yep, so did it, anybody find out what was going on at NASA the other day? Nope. They cut that feed? They cut the feed. It's actually a so-called video out that's saying that uh, it was an object. That approached the uh, space station. Space station. Yep. Mm. Yeah. So we know it was a, we know it was an object. Mm. You can take this, <laughs> bro. Ha! Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Hello. Yes, hello. What's up? Yeah, you know, he gone. He, he don't know we can still hear him, though. Even though he all the way in the back, we can still hear him. <laughs> yep, so y'all come on. Get some of these oils. I got two sizes. I got some soap. I got some shea butter. I got some... I got a whole store full of... whole store full of products. Hair care products, barber supply. Y'all come on down. 1638 West 95th Street, WDT Bar Supply. Right next door to 1634 West 95th Street. It's time, Barber Shop. It's an ITB Next Level podcast. Yep, yep. Huh. Who, who, who coming, uh, Kai? He said they coming. <laughs> Who coming? <laughs> oh, you know, them, them, them ETs. Oh, <laughs> he talking about the space station. <laughs> yeah. He talking about the Independence e Day. <laughs> they been here. It ain't nothing new. 
That's nothing new. Yes. They're here already. You seen uh the the, the movie Poltergeist? They're here. Shoot the, the fourth kind. Right. All of that. What up, brother in law? Ferris. What's good, brother in law? Oh, yes, yeah, sir. Got Ferris on there. What's yes, up, bro? Yes, sir. Yeah. One of the finest steppers, Shot Town's finest steppers, y'all. Super cold. Yes, sir. Smooth with Real it. Real smooth with it. Brother Ferris Henderson. <laughs> yes, sir. Brother in law. Facts. Yes, sir. That is the facts. Trying to see. Uh, huh. What up, gents? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Conway say he just want to see one in person. You just seen a bunch of them in person. <laughs> you just didn't know it. <laughs> oh, man. You seen quite a few in person. Mm -hmm. U.T. I don't know what UT is, uh, brother-in-law, but uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know if that stands for UT, because I'm not good with the Ebonics. So, uh, I'm good with regular. Somebody just sent that to you? No. Oh. Uh, Robo made his transition. Ah, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, one of the, one of the new brothers, of the, one of the... He is a right worshipful master of one of the Nuwabian grand, uh, one of the Nuwabian uh, lodges. Uh, Yamasu Lodge number nineteen, mm. and his name is Brother Asar Maat Ray Bernard James. He made his transition yesterday. Shout out. I want to say, uh, send some energy, send some, some uh, healing and and love energies down there to him and his family. Mm -hmm. You know, you, got, you, you with the Neteru now. Yep. You one the Nagaru. You one of the ancestors. Facts. Hey, Con, if you seen, if you happen to, check this out. This is what I always say to people. If you seen one face to face, what would you do, Con? <laughs> <laughs> if you seen an EBE, which stands for extra, extra biological entity, what would you do? <laughs> Anybody I ask that question. I don't know. I'd probably run. You'll run? I don't, I don't know. You don't know. That'd be, that would be the first, <laughs> that would be your first instinct. You know run. <laughs> run. <laughs> uh, at least try to. Run. 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 <laughs> you say I'm running, bro. <laughs> What it do? I'm running. <laughs> Lou say he running. <laughs> no doubt, Lou. What the hell? That's paint. She made it. My cousin, she, 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 uh. Oh, made injury like fake injuries? Yeah, she, she for, uh, Halloween. To, uh, trying to get into, you know, she said, time to take my talents to Hollywood. You know what I'm saying? Right, no doubt. So, so get into, uh, movie makeup. You know what I'm saying? Right, 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 right. Yep. Shout out to her. Shout out to my All the artists. Yes, Tyler yes. Williams. Yes, yes. Also, shout out to Tracy Webster. She's also an uh, artist, too. Oh, yeah, shout out to Tracy Webster. My sis, she does it. She gets down, man. Mm -hmm. Shout out to them, though. Man, them women doing their thing. Ain't nothing wrong with that at all. Shout out to my brother, Andrew Statica. Yes, sir. What's, What's up, Drew? What's up, Stati? What's up, brother Drew? Brother Drew, what's going on? Keep up the good work. Yes, sir. It's my cable talk. Drew got some things going on. 
some good mm-hmm. things. Keep up the good work, bro. We need you to come on up here and be on this podcast. Huh. Yes, sir. Bring bring brother Derek with you. Derek Perryman. Yep, who just had a, a birthday. Had a birthday. Yes, sir. He just had him a birthday. Mm-hmm. That is what's up. Yeah, man. Con, I'm waiting on your answer. <laughs> he didn't give me his answer yet. Mm-hmm. Oh, family bang, they coming. What happened? Oh, let me see. What that say? I just want to see. I seen some more stuff. Oh. Oh, Lucy used to like Blue Nile and Egyptian Musk. I missed that at first. I got all that. I get. I got all that. Blue Nile, Egyptian Musk. Egyptian. I got about four kinds of Egyptian Musk. Bro, we. Yeah, well, CPD. Yeah, but you know, all that's political. You know what I'm saying when it comes to that CPD and politics and all that, man. You know, we definitely need more. Of us. Yeah, that's the overlay for the underlay. <laughs> no, so you're gonna, you gonna get you're gonna get the brothers in there and, and they gonna they gonna be harder on you than, than yep. the uh, the other one. Facts. Shout out to my man uh Foulish. Yep, Larry. Larry Foulish mm-hmm. and Pam. Larry just had uh surgery. He got literally he has staples going up his neck. Mm. Spine, man. looking like Frankenstein for yeah, real. Soon, brother. Yep, my man Larry Fowlish. That's my man's man. Shout out to him and Pam, man. You better, Larry. Yes, you do. Yeah, I guess it's too early for my girl Erica to be on. <laughs> no doubt, Lou said that's the price we always pay to be great. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And it's crazy because we're already great, you know, and um, I tell everybody that um, if it's a, if it's something you do and you and you great at it, man, you should put it out there, man. Don't hold it back. That's with anything. Mm. What's up, my brother E. Kundale? Mr. Moncrief Bay, what's going down with you? Yes, sir. Oh, that's my brother there. Mm-hmm. Here you come. Yep. Right here too. You cut his hair, don't you? No, Tone cut. Tone cuts his hair. Okay. Tone cut him and his son. You know what I'm saying? But you know he, uh, you know he used to come to the to the, to the lodge. I know to the lodge yeah. and to the uh, open Sundays. Yep. Fourth Sundays. Come get some of that good information. Yeah, people don't have classes like that. Question and answer classes like that no more up here. Yeah, you ain't gonna find that nowhere else. They not gonna invite you they not gonna invite Mm-mm. you into their lodge and Mm-mm. stuff like that like we used to do. No doubt. Definitely not gonna find that. That's real. Man, I only play only real place you're gonna get that is right here. Yes, sir. We the only ones that's doing questions and answers. Yeah. <laughs> Facts. Facts. Whatever you want to talk about, we'll talk about it. Talk about it right here at 1638. West 95th Street. West 95th Street. WDT Supplies. Right next door, 1634. West 95th Street. It's Time Barbershop. ITB. Next level. Podcast. Next level podcast. Yep, you'll find that right here, y'all. We don't get too many people that you know that really ask questions, man. You know, we we'll be trying. Mm-hmm. You know, hope we ain't um, sh- shunning anyone away. That ain't what we want to do. Mm-hmm. Sherry, <laughs> what up, sis? Sherry, come on! I know you got it. I know you got a question, Sherry. Come on, put something out there. Statement, question. Come on, Sherry. My fault, bro. Come on with it. 
I know you got something for us. Sherry ain't got nothing for us. Sherry trying to get up to the what's name? 31st Street. <laughs> That's what you're trying to do, Sherry, get to 31st Street? Yep. And Lou, everybody pays the price. Mm-hmm. Sup, y'all. <laughs> yes, yes. Come on, Sherry, give me, come on, you be want to ask questions. Come on, this is the time right now. Ask one of them questions that you really want to ask. Come on with it. Don't hold back. Come on with it. Come on with it. <laughs> We wait. <laughs> right. Well, in the meantime, come on. We, we, let, we, give me a what's up. I mean, yeah. Give me a uh, what if. Come on with a what if. A what if. A what if. Mm. Uh, since 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 they was talking about it, what if? Extraterrestrials are really real. <laughs> Since that's what you wanted to talk about, uh, Kilikon, what if? What if your government been lying to you since 1945? Since the Roswell incident, which was actually two incidents, wasn't just one. It was actually two crashes. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Do we think they're going to pass the new abortion law here in Illinois? <laughs> you know what, Sherry? Probably so. <laughs> the, the abortion law, it, 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 it passed in, in all 50 states, but... Illinois, they're they they trying to they trying to overturn but, it. Yeah, but uh, you know what I'm saying. Here in Illinois, we are uh, what they call a, 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 a what is a haven state. Yep, haven state. You know what I'm saying. So, so shoot, one of the if, you, if you're an immigrant, if you a, a, a migrant, you know what I'm saying. If you a if you want want to get your abortion, if, mm -hmm. if you want to smoke weed, if you want to. You know what I'm saying? Marry the same sex. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Illinois. You can do it all in Illinois. Yep. Right here in Illinois. What is your ultimate destiny vision for blacks in America? How can we make it manifest? By doing what we're doing right now. Getting out the facts. Stop lying to each other. That's how we gonna change. The only way we gonna change is if we stop telling lies. That's why we like how me and we sitting here, even though you know, yeah, we do know uh, what we know, but people don't like to talk about it. That's why we we present what ifs. You know what I'm saying? What if? So people can open up. You know, what if this or what if that? Because we've been told something for so long and lied to for so long to now it has become a reality to so many people it's, it's a straight reality when it's not the reality it's truly not, it's like, it's like the Matrix when um, you watch the movie The Matrix, if you ever watch The Matrix and he told Neo uh, which pill he wanted to take once he took the the, the, uh, the, 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 uh, the red pill he actually saw the real world. He kept, he showed him the real. This is the real world, Neo. Not the fake shit. Not the the bull crap. You know what I'm saying? So, a lot of us is still taking the blue pill. You know, literally. <laughs> That's a little jokey joke. <laughs> but they are selling the blue pills like hotcakes in the, in them stores and in the gas stations. <laughs> Cats is buying them. Youngsters buying them blue pills, man. But not to get off the subject. Yeah. Um, the only way it's gonna change is if we start, you know, t telling the facts. Like I said, that's why me and we do the the what ifs. Like you know, you keep telling your your child 
every day that the sun is coming up. When the sun doesn't come up, it doesn't rise. It doesn't do none of that. It rotates. The planets rotate around the sun. You know what I mean? That's why just th this past weekend, you were able to see all the planets lined up. You know what I mean? And they rotate. They were rotating around the sun. That's why the sun was so so close and it's so powerful right now. You know what I'm saying? So what if, just like the solar system has a central sun mm. and they got nine planets rotating around it? Nine digestive system. What if? What if we had a central sun? Solar plex. With nine. Nine celestial bodies rotating around it. Nine digestive system. <laughs> What's that? The lymphatic nerves and we got we got we got we got we got nine organs. Yes. That rotate around our central sun. Mm hmm. Shout out What's to up, senior? Father BJ, Senior <laughs> BJ. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, you got you got. Just like you got a, just like the solar system, you know what I'm saying? We got a central sun, mm -hmm. our solar plex, you know, our solar plex, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And we also have uh, nine nine bodies moving around Facts. Our, our central sun. So in, within our body, you know what I'm saying? So so we are the we are the macro. Of the micro. I mean the micro. Micro of, of the macro. Of the macro. Yep. <laughs> we are the micro of the macro. Yeah. That is the just fact. Like, just like we got, we got, we got everything that's in the universe within our body. Hmm. And I'm talking, I'm talking about on, on down to, to the smallest quirk. Yes, sir. By aperture, zeos. Messions. Messions. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I know they like these niggas. <laughs> mm -hmm. But you can look that up and research yeah, it. You can research all of this. <laughs> anything that I anything that I say, you can look it up and research. Think it. about it. Twister came out with a song. Uh, what was the name of it? Uh, oh man. Oh. He was like protons, neutrons, electrons. You know what I'm saying? He snapped on that song. I forgot the name of it, man, but he snapped on it. And he was uh, Hans Boson. Boson. He's on Boson, right. So he was snapping. He was dropping mad jewels. And we know where he got it from. <laughs> mm -hmm. We definitely know where he got it from. That's a fact. Got it from studies. First lady, what's happening? What's up, Kanisha? Kanisha. Mm -hmm. Walker. <laughs> what up, sis? Always a pleasure. Always. Yes, yes. Always a pleasure, sis. Shout out to the whole Walker family. Anyway, my brother Coco, Coco. sis Monica. Kuma. Kuma, Takuma, <laughs> yeah. Dad and Mom, yes the sir. The whole Walker family. The whole Walker family, mm -hmm. shout out to them. Kim, mm -hmm. yep. <laughs> shout out to them, yes sir. Awesome family, man. Awesome family. Definitely. Yep, give a shout out to... Uh, John Foster Dulles Elementary School. I'm gonna give a shout out to James McCosh mm -hmm. Elementary School. I'm gonna give a shout out to uh, Sin Bulldogs High School. That's your high school, bro. Yeah. <laughs> All my alma maters, y'all. Huh? <laughs> yes, sir. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah, so we we we've been sitting there and we've been kicking on the kicking the bobos with y'all for over an hour. Facebook be letting us do all kind of stuff. I appreciate that. I appreciate y'all for listening in and mm -hmm. watching. Cause you could be a a whole bunch of other places doing a whole bunch of other things. 
Yes. But you're here with us. <laughs> and I want to thank y'all for that. Yep. I want to thank everybody that came and and um, that keep supporting and, mm. and come on and, and check us out. And that's going to keep us going because we're going to keep going. If it's one viewer or one million viewers. Hey, what's up, Miss Davis? Paula McKillar Davis. She said hello from Mississippi. Hey, how you hey. doing? All the way from Hello back from Chicago. Am I quicker letter, quicker letter? Yeah. What's happening? She's from the humpback humpback state. Yes, sir. <laughs> Thank you for uh, coming on checking us out. Oh yeah. And we try to do this podcast every day um, and keep up on current events and keep up on our people, you know, and uh, man, because this is an outlet to our people mm -hmm. and if you really want the real, man, please, by all means, you can come on. You can come. <laughs> right, you can come in here. You can you sit come in, us. sit yeah. right with be us. On air. Man, be on air. We can chop it up, talk about whatever you want to talk about. That's why the, the statement is so broad. The opinions and views of the world in all walks of life. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's why it's just, that's why it's so broad. The statement is so broad. So right. we want y'all to come on here and hang out with us. Right. And chop it up, you know. I know sometimes people get tired of listening and looking at us. You know, see, we we ain't the we ain't the uh, most handsome. Huh. You know what I'm saying? Man, but we are some real brothers. Indeed, I'm gonna definitely hit you with the facts. Yes, sir. And if and if I don't if I don't have the facts, I will go find it. For you. Go find it. I'm gonna hit you with the jewels. Yes, we are. Definitely going to hit you with the good jewels. Mm -hmm. Yep, so. Yep, the time is 5.21 p.m. September 22nd, 2022. And we've been on here for an hour and some change. Mm hmm Oh yeah, you getting your laugh on? <laughs> Who said that? Oh, <laughs> oh, she gonna laugh on with us? Yeah, <laughs> that's what's up. We we love to make people laugh. Oh, what what Lou say? I missed it. Hold on. Uh, I agree. We really need to educate our children who are most vulnerable. Facts. Let's go. Shoot some hoop, man. <laughs> yeah, that 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 yeah, very vulnerable. And and you gotta realize, and I get it. You know, parents been taught something for so long by their parents, and um, and they just told them that's the way it is. Don't ask no questions. But yet, when you go to school and you first learn it, that's the first thing they tell you to ask questions. So it's like an oxymoron. You know what I'm saying? You stuck in between. Mm -hmm. You don't really know how to say, well, okay, my mom and them told me don't question. But then when I get to school, they tell me to ask questions. You know what I'm saying? So that's confusion, and that's done purposely. That is to confuse the brain and make us confused. So. Yeah, that's just like in church. You know what I'm saying? They tell you don't don't, don't question God. Right. You know. Don't ask any questions. All of these words in this Bible are supposed to came from God. You know. So. In the beginning was the word. And the word was with man. And the man was word. And the word was man. <laughs> but yeah, that's that's they tell you that. But mm -hmm. so that, that makes people confused, man. It's definitely confusing. You know, I could sit here and recite certain passages from the Bible, the Quran, the Injil, the Torah, you know what I'm saying? And yet when I recite these things and then I ask questions because they in this book. You tell me I don't have a right to ask questions. No, this is just how it is. Be quiet. That's some put some fear or that's some uh some punk you type. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Have faith. Oh faith, you know. <laughs> oh, what's up the thing? 
My brother Eric, Eric Battles. What's up, Big E? What's crack a lack a lack? My nigga E, what up, dude? My brother is in the house. Shit, you, you can come on. You can come on here and drop some some gems of your own, brother. Hey, Devon. Devon. That's Devin. Hey, Devin. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, Eric Battles. Yes, sir. I mean, and by the way, that brother is uh, doing the ecological, or I mean, the uh, eco. Yeah, eco, right? Saving, you know, us from to save the planet. These crazy things that they're doing, as far as uh, burning fuel and all that. Where well, that brother has a, a team of people that actually go around and pick up the garbage and. And uh, put back into the uh, into the agricultural, far as planting and gardening and things like that. So shout out to that brother Eric Battles, man. Yeah, Keep up the good work, bro. bro. Yes, sir. And his brother is a rapper, and he's pretty good at it. Landon Battles. Yes, he yes he is. He's pretty good at it now. <laughs> I remember when he first started. <laughs> he cold with. He wasn't so good at it. <laughs> But shout out to the brother. He put the hard work in, man. That brother is good at it, man. So shout out, man, to Landon. Definitely battle. Yeah, Keep up say, the good work. Eric say indubitably. Indubitably. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. E. That brother is a Coast Guard. Uh, we're talking yeah. about Eric Battle. He's a Coast Guard, man, helping the people. And that's what the brother love to do. So, man, shouts out to you, my brother, Eric Battles, for sure. Mm-hmm. Definitely shout out to you, bro. And shout out to all those other people that's, you know, out there uh, in that field as far as uh, uh, nursing and, you know, things of that nature. Uh, fire department, you know, because it's tough. I know it is. I've been there, done it. So I know that IIT, oh my goodness. Hey, I want to give a shout out to my baby, my daughter. Hey, Nisi. Marie Bradley. Hey, Nisi. Yeah. Shouts out to Nisi. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. She's at work and she keeps trying to come in and out. That's what's up. You know what I'm saying? One day you don't you have to just come on on here and be be on air with us. You know what I'm saying? Oh, she said she'd be trying to come you out and listen. My, you, can bring my, <laughs> you can bring my grandson. You know, son, 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 yes, sir. Uh, Mr. Amir. Son, son. Come on and he, he could be on air, too. <laughs> no doubt. It's about the babies at the end of the That's day right. anyway. It's about the children, man. That's why we always encourage people, if you got teenagers and all that, man, bring them, let them come get over here, man. Let them express they self because everybody always down in the youth and, and getting on them and they never ask them what they want or what they want to do. It's always all the youth this, the youth that. Mm-hmm. Pounding them and pounding them. And if, sometimes if you just take and ask them, you know what I'm saying? What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? Or well, how do you feel about this? That's right. You know what how I mean? This make you feel. It ain't always about because I'm the parent and I say it. So I know people say that all the time. I'm the adult. That don't make you right. Because you're the adult. There's right. a lot of stuff as adults that we do some dumb shit. Plain and simple. Just being real. You know, and children, man, they sit back. They watch. They pay attention, man. And, uh... We got some smart children. Mm-hmm. I know we do. I know they smart. I got some. <laughs> they smart as a whistle. And it's crazy. Every time I go up to the school or go somewhere, they always talking about my children. So, you know, and I see other children, you know, they're smart. Very smart. And what the, the, the way they put words and phrases together mm-hmm. lets me know how smart they are man i was talking to your son satep yesterday mm-hmm. man satep satep's vocabulary is is off the chain it is <laughs> it's in Bach too yep i'm talking about he, he he can hold a conversation with the best of them about anything facts he's 11 <laughs> he's 11 <laughs> he's 11 Sometimes I got to get on him, though, because when it's time sometimes to be loud, he be quiet. I be like, boy, you're down there with that game all. I can hear you all the way outside. When I, when I need you to get loud, sometimes you don't get loud. <laughs> you know, so. 
And of course, you know, just like the teachers, when I go, they, I, one of the teachers, he's like, man, I, I, I love the way you named your children, you know. He's like, I know they got me. I know they got meaning. So he was like, cause ain't no other children have these names in the school that's close to it. That's right, Paula. Them Brazzles are for sure smart. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, we are. Yes, sir. Oh man, shout out to Doe. What up, Doe Ski? What up, Doe? My big brother Doe. What up, Doe? What up, Doe? Doe. <laughs> yes, sir. Shout out to Doe Ski, man. Yes, sir, my brother. We yeah, gonna keep I, on doing this. Shout out to my cousins, uh, uh, Johnny Glenn Brazel and uh, Barbara Ruth Brazel, on their fiftieth anniversary. Fifty years, y'all. That's what's years. up. Yeah, Lou, I remember that too. Teen Summit on BET with the children. Mm -hmm. Need to express themselves together. Yeah, they don't, they took it off because they actually were coming together, expressing and talking about real live uh, views of the world. And anytime you know we come together and start talking about stuff that actually means something, you know they're gonna take it off or get rid of it or label it as bad. <laughs> well, you know that was that, that was that was uh, pre Viacom uh, BET. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that was before before they, they sold. Wow. Rob Johnson he sold his uh, interest in BET to Viacom. So mm. when he did that, they 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 changed the whole format. Want to hear some breaking news? Massive volcano erupts in Tonga could wind up warming the earth. Oh yeah, it's warming the earth. It just erupted. Shop down the Tonga. You know we on air. <laughs> well, that's cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, that's cool. Well, welcome, welcome, uh, my brother, my brother, uh, how young Wes. How y'all doing? <laughs> blessings, blessings, blessings. Yeah. Hey, but you know my homie, little um, barbershop. Yeah. He got a hog. Yeah. yeah. I'm having a party tomorrow. tomorrow 89th, 89th in uh, Ashland. 89th in Ashland, y'all. Yeah. Wes. Yeah. He having the, he having the, she having his uh, pre-birthday bed. Yes, sir. The brother down is. Down on 89th. Man, tell the people how old you're going to be, my brother. Come on, tell the people how old you're going to be. 49. 49. That's what's up, man. Knocking at 50. That's a blessing. A lot of people cannot say that. For real. Yes, and sir. what I mean by that, the ones that live the street life. Because when you live that street life, hey, it's a whole hey, nother world. Let, hey, let me see. Let me, let me show my homie how big that is. I need the address too. That's his barbershop. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Just the hall in the back. Oh, yeah. It used to be General Persuasion, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know what that's it. That's right up there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Super nice. That's nice. I'm going to be DJing up there. That's what's up. Hey, hold on. Let me, um, I'm about to, hold on right there. What's the address? What's the address, bro? Yeah, we're going to send it to Oh, okay. Hold on. I want to show the DJ. That's the old general persuasion, persuasion right there by the track. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's big in there. Yes, sir. That is definitely me. Yeah, Paul. <laughs> Cuzzo. Yeah, we lost Video Soul too, Lou. That is a fact. Yep, and my, my cousin used to be on Video Soul. Her and Donnie Simpson. Her name's Angela Stribble. Yep. Yes, sir. To... Yep. That's what's up. Well, mm -hmm. me and the brother Wu, gonna cut up out of here. Yeah, it's about that time, y'all. Right here at sixteen thirty-eight West ninety West ninety-fifth Street, WDT Supplies, right next door, sixteen thirty-four West ninety-fifth Street. It's time barbershop. ITB Next Level Podcast. What's that address for the people, my brother? Eighty-nine fifty-one Ashland. And when is the party? 
Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. 8.30 to 3.00. Y'all come kicking with Wes, y'all. Come kicking with the brother Wes, no man. No hanging out front. No hanging out front. You know, park, you get a parking space on 91st. 91st. I mean, uh, 89th. 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 And then I got you 89th and like yeah. where Ashland at. Yeah, right okay. by the gas station. You can park on the side street. You can park in a little lot behind where the Alderman office and stuff at. Walk down. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, that's what's up, man. You got you getting searched to get in. You know what I'm saying? Drink. It's going to be drinking and smoking in the inside. I got to let people know that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people don't like to smoke in the inside. Right. You know, you can smoke your cigars. You can smoke your... Smoke your... Your weed. Your weed, weed is legal. Yeah, it's legal, <laughs> Marijuana is legal, man. You smoke yes, your weed. I'm out of All right, my brother. Yes, sir. <laughs> T Rod. T Rod the God. What's up, T Rod the God? Yes, sir. Yeah, man. But uh, like we were saying, about to get ready to get up out of here on y'all. Yep. We about to go get our boogie on. Huh. You know? Yep. Oh. Click. Huh? We don't own the rights to this. We don't own the rights to this music. Oh. Was just a young boy standing out my blind till I got free from my mama. Yes, sir, y'all. ITB Next Level Podcast. I got to ride. Yes, sir. We love everybody. Peace and love. Yes, sir. You win some, you lose some. That's just how it happens. And if a nigga step up to you, then you gotta scrap him. Your name is.